In today's video, we're going to be taking a look at my X-Men haul from the old book barn. So stay tuned. Hey guys, welcome back to Come Again TV, the only place on YouTube where all geek culture collides. If you're new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on future videos. I was at the old book barn the other day, and I received some sad news. It seems the old book barn is going to stop selling comics. Uh, at the end of the month, or whatever's left is going to be recycled. So currently they have all their comics for 10 cents a piece. So the other day while I was there, I picked up about 80 comics. Which means I've got a few haul videos coming out for you guys. Alright, so the first comic in this X-Men comic book haul is from the House of M continuity with New Excalibur. Uh, I really like the artwork on this, uh, on the cover of this comic. Very nice, you got Captain Britain here, uh, you got Juggernaut, uh, you got a female version of Nightcrawler, and I'm not sure who that is in the background. I, I never really kept up on my X-Men comics, probably should have, uh, but I just, I really like the art style of this. Of course, this is by Claremont, Ryan, and Ketchum. Uh, Chris Claremont is known for his X-Men comics. Uh, that's probably his biggest, his biggest claim to fame are his X-Men comics. Up next, we have X-Factor, number 119. Uh, again, another nice cover. Um, doesn't really say on the cover who it's by except for the signature here which can't really make it out um, again these old book barn comics aren't in the greatest greatest of condition but they are nice to have nonetheless up next we have X-Force number 51 from the X-Men Deluxe line, a Boomer Approaches Meltdown. Another very nice cover. Boomer, the look of Boomer, it kind of reminds me of Jim Lee's art style. Very nice, I love the vibrant colors. Then we have Generation X number 27 from May of 97. At the mercy of Bastion, could Jubilee really be the sole survivor of the X-Men? Again, another very nice cover, bright and vibrant. Love the 90s when they did the, all these bright and vibrant comics. 90s, early 2000s is when these were really popular. Generation X, number 20, part of the Heroes Reborn story arc. Uh, think these guys look desperate? Take a look at the foul chap that offers them a ride. <laughs> Again, another very nice comic. Uh, nice and vibrant. Love it. I think this is skin here. Uh, I'm not too familiar with Generation X, uh, so forgive me. Again, I haven't kept up on my X-Men comics. Uh, and I wasn't a big fan of Generation X anyway. I have read maybe a handful of comics. Up next, we have X-Force number 40. I couldn't remember if I had already gotten this issue or not. Uh, so I went ahead and picked it up. They had a number of copies. You got Shatterstar here. Uh, I'm not sure if that's Wolfsbane. And I can't, I don't know who that is in the back. Madness and Murder. Again, another nice, bright, vibrant cover. <clears throat> then we have X Man number seven. The lady's name is Celine. Celine, of course, is the first mutant. Uh, older than Apocalypse, guys. So X-Men was a very popular character during the 90s. He came from the Age of Apocalypse storyline. He and Holocaust and Dark Beast 
Uh, somehow, I'm, I'm a little foggy on the details, but somehow they left the Age of Apocalypse and came to regular Earth. We have Excalibur number 106. Again, another nice, vibrant cover. Inner Demons, External Threats. External, external Threats. You got Colossus here on the cover. I think this was around the time, uh, maybe like right before he uh, Colossus's death. Then finally, we have Generation X Deluxe number four. Holiday Spectacular. In Trouble with the Law. M. In Trouble with the Law. Chamber finds a butterfly. Banshee in a load of trouble. Husk and her new mentor, the White Queen. A disgruntled and squished skin, cinch, and jubilee. And the return of a major villain. Generation X Holiday Spectacular number 4, X-Men Deluxe. Again, another very nice, vibrant cover. I hope you guys enjoyed this haul video. Take care. Hey guys, if you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit that subscribe button right there so you can stay up to date on all things geek culture also you can check out one of these two playlists right here on the side for more videos just like the one you just watched